Hey guys, it's Sarah here from Sarah's Pipe Dream Soap Art. Um, we are going to make some um, lotion bars here and they are super convenient in the little deodorant um, things because then you don't have to have any lotion on your hand. You just kind of spread it on your skin. And I have my great niece, Aubrey here. Aubrey, how old are you? Nine. You want to say hi to everybody? So she's going to help me. Um, this is a pot of the very hot oil. So she's going to be adding stuff and I'm going to be stirring so that she doesn't get burnt. Um, but we're going to get started. We're going to make some lavender chamomile lotion bars here. Um, so we both got our gloves on and we're ready to get started. So in this pot, I already have um, the main ingredients for the oils that you need, which was um, we, we are using some hemp seed oil for this um, batch and I get this from Arizona Soap Supply in Phoenix and it is refined. Um, I use the refined when I'm making chopsticks and lotion bars and stuff because then it takes the smell of hemp, the hemp oil out of it and all you smell is the lavender chamomile. And then um, cocoa butter also is already added in there and then some beeswax. And those three things are already in the pot. Here, I did the double broiler method so that I didn't overheat them. And she was in there, and Aubrey was in there helping me stir and, keep, and keeping an eye on it. Um, but we do that rather than microwaving it so that the um, hemp seed oil um, and the cocoa butter and stuff don't lose the natural properties um, by getting too hot. So we're gonna get started. Um, first, we're gonna add the vitamin E which is this one right here, Aubrey. So you want to pick that up? It's hard. It is hard because you're, she's got Oy. no gloves that fit her hands. So I'll pick it up. There you go. And then you just kind of be very careful. Yeah. And you could actually stick it in there if you wanted to and just throw it around. So this is some vitamin E. Vitamin E is very good for the skin. There you go, that's good. All right, so we got the vitamin E in. And then the next thing we're going to add here is the lanolin oil. I get the pure lanolin oil also from our local Phoenix in Phoenix from um, the Arizona soap shop there too. So Aubrey's gonna add the lanolin in here real quick. It's hard, huh? This yeah. Lanolin is very sticky and gooey. There you go. The heat will help melt it off of it. Just make sure, remember, do not get burnt. Yeah. Okay, let's see. I'll help you out here. The lanolin is um, very, obviously, very hydrating for the skin, um, but it is very sticky and hard to work with. <laughs> So, I don't know what it's like. What, what would you say this is like? It's just like... Um, it's like Play-Doh slime stuff. Slime? Both Play-Doh like, and slime together or something? Yeah, because okay. it's like sticky and then it's hard like Play-Doh. Sticky but hard like Play-Doh. That is yeah. very good. That is very good. Okay, so you have better eyes than me. Tell me when I start all the little clumps out here. Almost. Mm, looks like. Are we good? Mm, we're good. Okay, so now you're going to add the lavender and chamomile essential oils that we already have weighed out right here. So you just go ahead and pick those up and pour them all in here. Make sure we get all of them in there. Oh my gosh, did you see how fast that cooled off? Yeah. Like it just a little bit went in there and it's all cooled off like fast. Okay, so we got. Now let's go smell it. We gotta smell it to make sure that we might need to put more of that um, mm -hmm. lavender yeah. chamomile in it, huh? Yeah. Yeah, because right now you just smell the beeswax yeah, and the cocoa. Yeah, it smells really good. I like the smell. She likes to smell beeswax and cocoa butter. So I'm going to get the, um, you can stir this as long as remember, you make sure you don't touch this. Well, this isn't hot anymore, okay? It's warm, but it's not hot. Yeah, it's, it's cooling off on the side. 
That's exactly what you do. You just scrape it. Okay, so let's see if this smells better. What do you think? Mm -hmm. If this gets too melty, um, too hard, we just have to stick it back in that, that water bath, remember? We'll just have to stick it back in the water thing on the stove to get a little more hot. Just for a little bit, yeah. Okay, so. You just need a tiny bit more of that smell. You think so? Okay, let's. Just a tiny bit more, you're right. Yeah, okay. Where'd the bowl go? Do you see the glass? <laughs> oh, see, see, this is why I need a helper, right? You yeah. can tell the camera stories if you'd like. You know, how you always have to help your Aunt Sarah when she loses stuff. Yeah. Well, um, a couple, like, like, a long time ago, you, like, you, 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 like, lost your mind, kind of. Yes, I was, and, I was really sick with my Meniere's disease, yes. And <laughs> you kind of, like, you kept losing your glasses. Yes. So you had glasses on your head, your face, and in your shirt. <laughs> yes, I did, and I, and I still lost them. Okay, so, is it helping? Mm -hmm. There you go. You tell me. Stir it. I think we're good because when this cools, this you're not going to smell the beeswax and stuff as much. Oh. Okay. So and we have a lot of essential oils in there. I can't do um, any more than that for the skin. So we got everything in here that we need to put in here, um, except we were going to put some of these in, huh? Yeah, we were. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to pour, I'm going to pour the first half without any of the lavender in it and let it cool a little bit and then pour the top with some lavender in it. So it's not all through the bar, but it's, it's on the top of the bar because when you do it the other way, the lavender settles to the bottom and it just sits on the bottom. So we're not, we're going to not do that. So we will, I'm going to pour this. Okay. You got that. That's perfect. So I'm going to pour this in here real quick. And then I'm going to go put the rest of this back on the stove. So then all we do here, Obs, is, yeah, I'll set that down all the way because, yeah, there you go. So I'm going to pour half in, and then I'm going to leave a little room for the rest to be poured with that um, lavender in it. Okay. Can we so put you just the lid on it? Not yet. Not yet. We're just going to let it sit and, and cool off a little bit, and then we'll put the lavender part in it, and then when it cools off, we'll put the lid on it. See? Looks like this one needs a little bit more. We're doing it right on that line there. You see that one? Because then I'm going to come back and fill it all the way to the top oh, okay. with, the, with the lavender in it. So this is full all the way. So if we get half of this done, then we'll go get the warm stuff and we'll, we'll put the lavender in it and then we'll pour it on it's the top. I know. I'm going to have to get this warmed back up too. I'll scrape it out and put it back in, I think. So I'm just filling these up, like I said, halfway. Um, and then we're going to go add the fresh lavender in and do the top half. We, I think we might be, Aubrey might be staying the night tonight, huh? Maybe if mom says yes. Yeah. Maybe. So you see how this is, this is hardening up already? Yeah. Let me yeah. touch it. Yeah. See That's it feels? lotion. Yeah. So we will um, go, we'll let these cool off for a little bit while we go get the rest of it and put some lavender in it. We poured, we got all of the, um, Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. <laughs> we got all of the lavender chamomile um, put in here for the half bar. And then, what did we put in here, Aubrey? You're such a weirdo. Uh, what did we put in here? Do you remember? Uh, what kind of seeds? Lavender seeds. Lavender seeds, yes. Okay. <laughs> so now we're going to fill these up. With lavender seeds. All the way to the tippy top. The rest of the lotion. Yeah. And we're filling it to the tippy top because some people they might have to twist and twist and twist. And we want to get all, all of the lotion and not chip them. <laughs> yeah. No second, no half bars. It's well. 
All right, you be my eyes and tell me when it's exactly at the top, okay? Okay. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and that happens sometimes we spill so at the end I will have to after it dries I have to go clean everything up real quick. it's kind of hard with all this lavender you see how it's like yeah. bunching up okay. so. now this hold on a one. second let me clean this out here there we go and then this one <gasps> Well, you don't want to get burnt by it, so no. Back up a little bit so the camera can see what we're doing. Okay, there we go. So I'm spilling, right? <laughs> Everywhere. Everywhere. Um, apparently. But we're getting it done. Some have more in them than the others do. You know? Yeah. Okay. It's fine. Yeah, they're ready to be done. Don't throw the oil on them. Okay, wow. Well, this well, one well, not ready. Yeah, those will be it's fine. Kind of ready. It doesn't have to be mm -hmm. all the way hard. Just see, it's not. It's not gonna melt. You know, it's not that hard to get to. You know, ready to go. <gasps> That's what happens. See, luckily those are ready, right? And they weren't ready. No, I mean, look. Like the red ready, like it was in there. No, it's a good thing, <laughs> or else it would have spilled. Thank you. Those go. are set. My base yeah. is gone. My yes. chapstick gone. Everything. Gone. gone. <laughs> the picture gone. Uh oh. No, not they don't want to do that, right? Really. No. No. Okay. I think like I think this one, this one, this one, and this one, and this one, and this one have the more seats. And yeah. that one. Yeah. Some of them have more seats than others. But this one has like these two have like barely any seeds. Yes, I know. They're like waiting there for more seeds. <gasps> well, you know, look it. Yeah. That's okay. This is what happens. This is what happens. It's okay. So we're gonna now. bring these to the store and it's gonna be ready. It's gonna be all melted on the side. No, no, we, we clean it up. They clean these all up once they harden. Once these harden, we're gonna come on. We're gonna wipe the outsides of them off really good, um, and clean them up and so we can put, put the lids on. The wrapper on. The lids, and then I gotta make. I gotta make. Um, the wrapper. Yeah, I have to make labels for them. So look, we got those all done. So I'm gonna do some fun ones. Yeah. Hello Kitty. Yay. How about that? Yeah. Okay. Fun soaps. They're they're lotion bars. Oh, they are. Yeah, remember? Oh, yeah, yeah. So these would be some really fun Hello Kitty lotion bars They're for the kids. Because so... it's lavender chamomile, so it's yeah. really good for your skin, and kids are allowed to have lavender and chamomile. And plus, but they aren't allowed to eat it. Do no. not eat this. Yeah. <laughs> if you eat it, no it's eating. very bad. Thank you. Bye-bye. Gone. This stuff? Oh, lanolin, yeah. So you don't want to ingest lanolin. That's what she's talking about. And also, um, one funny thing I found about lanolin is it's derived from wool, from sheep's wool. So if you're allergic to wool, then you do not want to use lanolin. It's if, yeah, if you're allergic to anything from sheep's, do not use it. Yes. So... We got them all poured. We got a little bit of mess, but we'll clean it up. So um, when we get it, when I get it all cleaned up and some labels made, we'll come back and show you what it looks like. All done, ready to go. All right. done, ready all right. to be packaged. Yep. And then we're gonna bring them to the store, and yeah. But you get to have one of these little kitties, though, right? Um, do you want that? Yeah. All right. So till next time. Bye. So this is super moisturizing for the skin. All you do is um, twist it up a little bit and rub it on your skin like this. Um, that's that la fresh lavender seeds that are on the top there. And um, I just love the way that it feels on your skin. Uh, it's super hydrating and it stays on your skin a lot longer than regular lotion. 
It's super easy to apply. And I love the smell of the cocoa butter.